Hey there golfers, I'm Drew Mahal, the Second Swing Golf. I'm joined by Thomas Campbell, a Master Club Fitter here at Second Swing. And today we're testing out some new putters uh, from Odyssey. They are the two ball and the 10 putters, new for 2021. Odyssey has put a lot of work into refining that shape and improving performance for golfers on the greens. And so Thomas, we've got three models uh, of the nine that we've been able to test out here. Uh, but I know you're familiar with Odyssey putters and especially triple track, which is also a key feature in uh, several of these styles. So um, give me your feedback on just triple track and Odyssey's kind of white hot micro hinge insert as well, using it over the years and then maybe what you've seen so far out of these putters. Yeah, you mentioned triple track. It's another version to really showcase the alignment options that we have to really help to make sure you get yourself to start that ball started on the right line when you're putting. And triple track is a definitely mm -hmm. a great option. And well, we've actually got some, some extra line, different alignment options on mm -hmm. these new putters. So really high MOI putters, but with a lot of exceptionally good alignment aid op opportunities. Yeah, so there's you know, essentially three different alignment aids that uh, Odyssey has implemented into this series out of the nine styles. So you've got your two ball, which is a classic from Odyssey. It's been around for almost two decades now. Kind of your two ball design on the club head. Probably the newest one is triple track, which is the uh, three lines, uh, kind of with different colors on the club head. And you can also see that and match it up with the golf ball as well on the triple track golf balls. Then of course, you've got your kind of boldened white lines as well on that black club head. Um, so three different options. Again, and this is all player preference, right? Depending on what you like to look at, at address, what's the most effective for you, which is why coming in to test these out is gonna be so important to seeing which one's right for your game. Uh, but we gotta get into some more of this technology. So the white hot micro hinge insert, uh, they've kind of, I mean, it, I mean, all of this started with the white hot insert back 20 some years ago, and they've added these micro hinges on there um, to really improve that roll at impact. Um, it also provides a very soft feel. Yeah, and it gives you much better speed and control on the greens mm -hmm. as well. So having that micro hinge insert, gonna get that ball top spin on the ball, which is gonna get the ball to roll out exactly how you expect it to do on the putting mm -hmm. green. Now this club head, so you're gonna see a very similar club head shape with all nine styles here. Um, they've got, you know, it's a modern mallet design and they've got some extra weight brought back behind the heel and toe. So the stability is going to be there with all of these. Um, and then really the decision to be made here is about your stroke type and then about the preference in terms of alignment aids. And that's going to help a golfer because each one has that high MOI design, very stable, resistant to twist, um, but also that my, white hot micro hinge insert. The, the, the really, again, the decision to be made, the uh, alignment aid that you like, and then in terms of the slant or the hosel type on the putter that's right for your putting stroke. Yeah, with these putters, most of the putters, that you know, with them being very high MOI, they don't have a huge amount of toe hang on them. So they're not blade type mm -hmm. putters. The, the, the 10 is, is more of a straight back, straight through type putter. Now I'm holding the 10 slant. It's got a little bit of toe hang kind of looking down at it here mm -hmm. too, but not gonna be a crazy amount because it's really designed to get that ball to, what, one, to be very stable off the club face, but also get their ball to kind of roll nice and straight, especially if you catch it on the toe or the heel. Right. We know that you catch it on those spots, there you know, may be some deflection going on if you yep. have a lot of toe hang on a putter. Yep, so I've got the 10 triple track here and you can see there, this is a face balance putter. So for those golfers, for example, that uh, take the putter straight back and straight through, this is gonna be a putter design for you. Uh, but overall, there are nine styles. So starting with the two ball putters, there's a two ball 10, the two ball 10 lined, the two ball 10 slant, two ball slant lined, and the two ball 10 slant triple track. And then the 10 models include just the standard 10, the 10 slant, the 10 slant triple track, and the 10 triple track. So lots of different modifications to make, um, but essentially the performance is all the same there. You get your high MOI head design, various different alignments to choose from, and then that, mi that white hot micro hinge insert to deliver that top spin, that soft feel, and that consistency on the greens. And make sure you don't forget about Stroke Lab. So mm -hmm. with the new Stroke Lab shaft, it has been upgraded a little bit. It is now seven grams lighter. It is stiffer and more stable to really enhance tempo and control and consistency on the putting green. So, so some slight modifications to the Stroke Lab. The Stroke Lab, we've seen it on tour. It's performing mm -hmm. exceptionally well on, on tour and for a lot of players give better stability on the putting green. Yeah, Stroke Lab has been awesome. I mean, they just, it's a great way to improve consistency on the greens. They basically take some weight out of the shaft and reposition it to sort of the head and then also the grip. And that's going to provide more consistency in the putting stroke. And of course they've upgraded it now in 2021 with 
um, this series of putters and the new Stroke Lab shaft. So, um, and of course, there's a pistol and an oversized grip option available with these here, with these putters. Uh, so again, there's a lot of different options for golfers to choose from here, but at the end of, it, of the day, the result is going to be a stable putter head and consistent performance. Yeah, and make sure you come in and get fit for the type of putter, whether you like the different alignment aids or you like a, a, a type of putter that has a little bit of toe hang or not much toe hang. There's plenty of options here in the new Odyssey 10 line as well. Mm -hmm. And of course, bring, make sure you bring in your old putter to be traded in when you make your upgrade to an Odyssey 2 ball or Odyssey 10 putter at Second Swing. So Thomas, thank you for joining today for this video and providing some insight. Not a problem, it's gonna be a great year for Odyssey.